Night. So yeah, we're not doing best three out of five for for finals here. Three, two, but one, go! uh, what are your thoughts on this matchup? Um, give me that hot four one one. I mean, both characters kind of want the same thing. In, like, you, in terms of the nair, like not the nair, but the the way that you're gonna that you're gonna get your combos. You know, like you can have to get the bear. And, and in terms of the spacing, um, yeah, I'm not really too sure. I've never seen this match in my life. One thing is that it seems like uh, Palutena's large frame actually it's pretty easy for her to a get shoveled and b for Martha to sort of just space around her. Yeah, for sure. As uh, we see in this match. I mean, both competitors are pretty, pretty high percents here. And both these characters actually have really good mobility, but I think that Palutena has more versatility in her mobility. Like, especially in the air. Uh, you know, oh, yeah, I yeah. feel like the way she drifts, she can drift in a way that Mark can't quite. Oh! Goddamn! Toe frame! He wanted it, and he got it, and only at 102%. This is Mr. <laughs> E's time to just steamroll and all oh, Jen with the falling net. Oh! 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 At this point, use the match for, use the match for data collection, and you know, if you see the, if you see the opportunity to get a kill, by all means go for it. Jen's a fighter. Like if you know the guy, he doesn't quit. Oh no, God! So even though he's down by quite a bit here, he's trading one and to one. It might not be great when you're down by this much, but nonetheless, he has ways to still make a comeback. Pelt's gonna get to it extremely early, uh, not just with our smashes, but also with our up air. So we're just getting some type of deep gimp, you know, like going out really for a high committal edge guard might work for him, especially when he's down by this much. For sure. Here we have, ooh. All right, just <laughs> this neutral, man. I love it. All right, and as you said, Jen is a fighter. He is back in this. And, oh, good parry by Jen. All right. Oh, the second one tried to, dra he tried to drag him down. Wow, he's like, a is he? Wow. Do you know there's still a mechanic in this game where you can't get two framed if you up, uh, teleport from above? Oh, I don't know. Ah. I'm learning a lot of things about this game as I commentate on. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you. Oh, great, basic. Unfortunately, not killing And Mr. E is. Ooh, Ooh the counter! Uh, the counter at least got him hit. off the ledge. But now he's at 148% trapped on the ledge once again. Not a tipper forward here, going to be keeping him alive. But he's still in such a risky position. Okay, great right, parry. He finally has a little bit of advantage. Let's see how much he can do with it. He's just continuing to survive, and, and that should be it. No, Buff doesn't have up throw anymore. They took away his up throw as a kill option. Really? He doesn't. It does not kill like it used to. I think Lucina had it. Lucina has it. Oh, oh in. the upper catch him, and he's gonna actually do it. Jen actually making him the. Crazy comeback! I was telling you about up there, not because <laughs> Palutena kills early. Well, I mean, wow. he, was, he was he was high though. Like, look at that. Yeah, no, he was super high up. That was very dead. And he was very had, much I dead. I think uh, Rage caps out at 180 in this game. Does it? It starts at 30. I'm asking you. I don't it starts know. At 30, I heard it caps at 30. Right? I'm pretty sure it's still 35 to 150. It's just the multipliers. It's the same different. thing. Okay. Yeah, right. the multiplier is no, much less. The oh, yeah. the multiplier used to be 1.15. Now it's 1.1. It's literally 30 percent weaker. Nice. It makes a huge difference. Well, it's you literally can, you, what? 35 percent weaker. Rage. Fifty percent less. Yeah. Okay. It's a third as wait. It's a Thirty. It's as sixty-six percent as strong as it used to be. Okay. Not, <laughs> I'm so yeah, well, we're back to this stage, and we got that sick Hyrule Temple music. Yeah, but he definitely had max rage. That's the, that's the point of that's the point of the whole thing. He had max rage. He got him with an up air, super high. 
and coming back from from all that too. The footstool at zero. <laughs> yeah, I gotta really give it to Jen. I was I was not expecting him to make that that game, and it feels like he's learned a lot. It might just be that yeah, even if you shake your head at the end of it, go yeah, okay, okay, that can mess with you. Oh no, for sure. I mean, even if you miss such, 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 such a commanding lead was was basically dropped, and you, you, you gotta hope that E doesn't doesn't let that get to him. It's okay, just ooh, good air dodge back to the ground. Okay, good job shielding. Actually getting a shield grab right there, but Mars throws only really give him a positional advantage. I wonder if he could have cleared out of shield right there. I hope that that will be sending him at a terrible angle. Okay, just look at that spacing by Mr. E. Again with the parries. The parries from Chen have been so good. They've gotten him bad with these bad situations. Yeah, he does. You see oh, just he how useful that is as a new mechanic. He does it on purpose, man. He knows. Oh, 100%. He knows. Great fading back here. Yeah, you know what? Just realized somebody put those there. confetti when somebody does. <laughs> I didn't notice it until like yesterday. Oh, okay, but once, yeah, does not have a kill throw, so he's forced to just be happy with some stage positioning. But he needs to be getting a stock here. Mr. E is taking oh, more and more no. damage. He has a jump. It's fine. But, uh, I mean, 62% ain't that fine. Okay, and not getting tippers. Yeah. And this is this is why, you know, a lot of players opt, opt, opt to play Lucino over Marth. But... I would actually... Oh, uh, if, they, if they end up meeting again in Grands... Yeah, he's in Lucino. Like, yeah, I feel like... I mean, that's that's very far down the road. Jen does not have this game in the bag at all yet. Back through... Toys! Does it. Neutral air, that's it! No, that's it for him! Oh. It was a good attempt. I mean, I, I thought he was there. It's okay. He loses his... He, oh, and there's wrong the other second. way. And Jen actually just catching for it. Great down tilt to fair. Gonna take the stock. That move is so good for covering ledge. Not only because it can hit opponents who are still grabbing, but if they double jump back, it can catch them. It just lasts for so long. You see Palutena's use it a lot. Um, just the threat of it. You have to be mindful of that now. Okay, come out. The neutral layers come out. Alright, Jen trying to get nasty. And uh, okay, yeah, I understand this idea behind that, but if Mr. E gets another down air, you do not get your jump back when you get two frames down. So he just gets down and he dies now. <gasps> That's it. No! That's game three. That's game two. That was it. I was... Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, ooh. Uh, that's super unfortunate. He air dodged him. Can we see oh, the good. boop? Can we see the boop play? The boop play? Was that a kill? Which one was it? There was a kill. It was a kill when he got booped. What stock was it? When he booped him. Uh, stock. Uh, Jen's Two. second stock of game one. Of game one? Oh, my God. Okay. Hold on. It's, was it important. the second stock taken? Yes. What's the ruling on like how you how you clip these? I things? clip every kill. Oh, yeah. Nice. You just use a button like clip. Yes. Oh That's actually how it God. works. And it clips like the last five seconds. Death. Thirteen seconds. Bruh. Thirteen seconds. Uh. It was it, what stock was it? The second, second stock second of that game. game what, it was the f second kill of yeah, that second game? kill of that game. Uh, so yeah, because he was he was up three stocks. Yeah. That's right, this he one? was. Yes, this one. Uh, I, I'm glad I found it. Here you go. You're so <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> The boop kill. Did you not understand what I meant by that boop kill? Perfectly John Squirrely. Squirrely, thanks for the subscription, boys. I miss uh, you. I'm, I haven't gracias, seen him in a while. Amigo, is he, Yeah, I haven't is seen Squirrely. Still playing, is, is my man still playing? Oh, Ganon? no, but I'm pretty sure you're hyped again. has an actual sword now. Except for the fact that it's made his smashes worse. Oh, my Ooh. God. Thank you. Zero X... 908 turns. <laughs> Thank you. I'm pretty sure it's It's supposed to be exonerated or something like that. Yeah. Oh I think my so. god. I, you're right. Oh. Thank you. Yeah, thank you, Squirrely. And I don't know what hex for OX90 is. So. But thank you so well, much. Well, you're you so special much, to us. Regardless. We definitely appreciate it. Uh, you know, if you like, if you like what, what what the house does, show them support, guys. These guys, these guys do a lot of work running these locals every single week. 
without fail. Rain, shine, your mom's birthday. It don't matter. Devin's mom's birthday. Yeah, word. <laughs> Devin, you can you come to my birthday? Mom, no. <laughs> I <laughs> just <laughs> am streaming. How do you know about this? <laughs> <laughs> I have ways, Devin. I have ways. Like, like the dildo you want? Anyway. It's all good. It's all good. <laughs> it's okay. We've all done it. This is this is a supportive environment. See, my mom's birthday is on New Year's Eve, so like I, I can't Yikes. I can't really skip that. Yeah. That's oh my wait. What time on New Year's I, Eve? I'm I'm definitely like I don't know. Did her did her mom just like cowered out on the whole no. first baby right, of the so New Year's right, thing? Right, hold on. So, all right, so Dominicans are weird, right? So yes, she was born February twenty eighth or twenty. No, yeah, eight, right? That's the day it lands on like the leap year. Like, she was born February twenty ninth. Yeah, that that that. Um, and then they they made her birthday December thirty first, and it's super weird. Like my my dad was born in like uh, October twenty. He, he was born on October twenty sixth, and then his birthday, he, they declared it on January thirtieth, right? And it's just. It's just, it's just, it's it's super weird, and I don't understand why. And I'm a very confused boy, man. <laughs> boy, man. Boy, man. man boy. Wolf. <laughs> man, wolf. All right. By the way, just so you guys know where we are at right now, we are Gen One Two L, right? Yes. Uh, yes, sir. Yeah. We're waiting on the winner of uh, Sinji and Venia to play Nixie All for right. losers. Semis. Oh, just semis? Right, yeah. Cool. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Let's let's let you guys know about more good things coming up. Uh, every oh, some more weekly it's fossil. Just, also, cool. every week there's undiscovered smash. They actually had a really nice monthly this past uh, Saturday. Huge pop. -up. Yeah, huge pop. -up. Huge. They had a hundred people, and the weekly is also just. Just as delightful. Oh, it's I hard to talk song. while I'm also listening to this song. I, I do love this song. But shout out to Undiscovered Smash. Shout out to Rick um, and the other uh, people that helped run it. It's it's great. If you're in the White Plains area, definitely head out, man. Um, 66 Fulton Street. Let's keep it going. We got... Want this! Okay, yo. Oh. So this is the Master Hand Gaming Gloves Off podcast. This is a really cute thing that uh, Chris from MHG does. I've been on it a few times. It's every Tuesday. Yes, it's still every Tuesday. Uh, definitely check it out. I think they have a SoundCloud for it, which if they do. Nice. What kind of stuff do they? Uh... Uh, we just talk. Uh, everyone just talks about like Smash news, like what's happening in Smash current events and stuff. It's really fun. That's it's really dope. cute. Yo, um, for yeah, sure, for sure. How do I ask to be a guest star? At him, probably. You get like every time I'm on it, I just get to be like, I'm an old man and I've been here for like 10 years and let's talk. How old are you? Like my age? I'm 26. Yeah. Hey, 26 yeah. buddies. Well, hey. I'm gonna be 26. I'm not the but, oldest one. Yeah, I mean, like, I'm a freaking like 2007 Smasher, so. Ah, yeah. Yeah. I didn't really like, like go out until like Smash 4. Yeah. I held tournaments like in my house for Melee and Brawl, but I didn't really like, yeah. like leave my house. It was Please, this is the magic of this podcast already. We're already just reminiscing. Oh, it's yeah, great. Sure, yeah, sure, so great. Uh, Gloves Off Podcast. Out. Definitely right. check it out. So shout outs to Fun, fun Size Mini. Um, making all the, uh, she, uh, she makes make, all the emotes for Yeah, the, she made all the, the emotes right? minus, uh, minus uh, Header, yeah. which Proton, Proton made. Proton. I love Proton that made. emote so much. The header? Uh, yeah, you I, know, I the, the, the Wii Fit spot. Oh, the Wii Fit spot. Header, okay. it's great. All right, but shout outs. Oh, the Deku one is adorable. Uh, yeah, give her a shout. Uh, give her, a, give, give her a follow, guys. If you want emotes made for your, for your stream, um, or you know something custom, definitely, definitely give her a shot. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. I guess you did. Yeah, there's also I like that one. Da Gauntlet. Now it's uh, this. Uh, it's just every. This is a biweekly. This is a biweekly. So it's every Correct. Tuesday. So it's every other Tuesday. So uh, one was yesterday. They kind of got messed up uh, by the holiday season because. Since New Year's and Christmas are literally five, uh, are literally a week apart from each other, that's two Tuesdays in a row. So they kind of got messed up by that. But uh, yesterday was the return, and so in two weeks from now, the 22nd, uh, they'll they'll be hosting again. It's yeah. at Next Level. Uh, and of course, it's a yeah. really great venue in Brooklyn. If you are one of those Brooklyn Smashers, it's right yeah. in your backyard. If you've been to if you've been to Smash Attack, it's yep. the same venue. Check it out. Uh, yeah, it's every other weekend. Um, yeah, so they got some cool stuff going on there. 
Uh, yeah, check it out. <laughs> For sure, guys. And of course, our very own Xeno Weekly, guys. Every single Wednesday. If you're new to the stream, I love you already. Thank you for tuning in. And if you, uh, you know, if you're returning, if you're returning, watch. Yeah. Sure. If, if you're if new, you're returning, I love you slightly. If you're new, yeah. welcome. Yes. And just so in case you don't know, this is happens every single week. Come yeah, yes. on through. Uh, it's in New York City, Chinatown. Thank you, Nika. Some Nika. Thank you so hey. much. Hey. Definitely, appreciate it. Definitely appreciate it. How how you doing, Nika? All right, I think we're getting into the match. It's all right. Sure, so yeah. Venia over Sinji gonna be uh, gonna fight Nick, Nick C, C now in loser in semis. Oh, and these are Take like. Away, boys. So here's the thing. Both, so Venia in particular, when I looked at the way he played Smash Four, it felt like he wanted. Man, to did like my man was in 2019 while we were in 2014. Yeah, no, like really, like, and, and that's one of the reasons why he's been able to transition to this game so well, winning two Xenos in a row. He did get knocked into losers, kind of surprisingly early, upset by uh, HO3, day one HO3K. Uh, oh my god, oh, then really? you know! Wow. Oh, 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 oh. El tiene una familia! <laughs> no puedes hacer eso, Venia! Por favor! Uh, All right, well, then you just have you being... met Nick's family? <laughs> I've only met his brother. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. <laughs> All right, so s this slippery frog just ended Nick's C stock in a matter of seconds. And now we haven't even hit the minute mark, and Venya's already showing how scary he can be. And this is why. This is a match I'd I'm actually really, really hyped about because both players want to end your sock as quickly as possible. <laughs> yeah, but only one of them seems to be doing a good job of it. Uh, it's all good, man. It was only the first stop. Uh, okay, I really shouldn't discount Nick. We've all seen what he can do. His explosive potential. Oh, he catches just the jump! So hard! Oh! Venya, looking like he has Nick's number right now. Yeah, and I mean, so Greninja is extremely fast actually has some of the best overall movement in the game, if not the best overall movement in the game. With solid air speed, great run speed, excellent fast fall speed. He just clocks out amazingly in each category. His frame data is a little bit inconsistent, you know? Like his forward air takes a while to come out. His, in general, like his moves might not be, it's not like sheep level, but this but ability to maneuver <laughs> mean like, how do you catch up with them? And as, as you're saying this, we see Nick just kind of just be tossed around by Benny over here. Oh, oh, that, uh, all right. How <laughs> the mighty have fallen. <laughs> Doesn't tech, gets the forward air. And look at that little grin. Look at that grin. Benny just. Listen, this, this guy is base 120. That is disgusting. Speed. You heard those, you heard. <laughs> that, those sounds were gross. <laughs> What the hell? <laughs> Nick has to think about sort of what went wrong, and it's hard to figure out when a game is. I'm not gonna say like that much. About I'm not gonna lie. But what when did, the what game did, is what that did, convincing, what didn't go wrong? What didn't go wrong? <laughs> exactly. Like, okay, so I know what doesn't work, but like, what does now? For sure. Um, maybe platforms. I'm just trying I definitely to think show that platforms, extra not biased. I, I, I definitely think the platforms. Are, oh, we're gonna take it back. You know, Nick was like, you know what? You got, you got that one stock. It's you all got Gucci. Lucky. Here we, here we are, gonna, gonna take it back, all right. All right, and this is this is, this is where Nick starts his lap. Yeah, no, I, we can make fun of Nick for that last game, but you gotta respect him as soon as he takes the change. Okay, apparently even though much went right that last game, he's figured out what he needs to be doing this next time around. That is, that is legitimately amazing. Like, <laughs> yeah. L like, we've literally just seen him adapt in seconds. But Venya no slouch either. Oh Ooh. my gosh! What is this? Put on the damage. We got the new Venya combos here? Only at Xeno. Brought to you by House of And he tapped. <laughs> you ever seen Dragon Ball the Bridge? You'll get that. Oh, yeah, no, I know. <laughs> <It's good. laughs> All right, the upper actually going to do it. See, that's the thing is that, so yes, that was some good adaptation from Nick, but another part of it is that that was all, he got all that damage from one neutral win, like one advantage state. 
you know, that he managed to find. And since then, Benny manages to get back in the driver's seat. He's barely been touched since he that amazing start that uh, Nick had. Oh, good, good tricky movement with the upbeat. And uh, catching a jump. Nick, he doesn't have a jump right now. Oh, the shadow oh. sneak. That hitbox seems like it's smaller than it used to be. Am I wrong? Uh -huh. Nick, okay. All right. Falcon's dash dance, his initial dash looks weird. Seems like a slow initial dash. I'm not sure. Smacking him out with the forward smash. All right, Venya is schmoving right now. All right, the dash attacks up to, up to, oh, up smash, my bad. Oh, great pivot grab. Oh, just forcing me to see the air dodge and catching him. Oh my god, Venya is eating this man alive right now. Nick has to come up with an answer and soon because he's on his last stop. Look at this pressure right now. Nick's finally giving, like, even when Nick has room to, like, you know, dash back and forth and breathe, Benny just fixes his timings carefully. A sneaky back here just weaving its way in. Oh, but I like that Nick is actually able to put on him, but once again, it doesn't amount to much. All right. Ben <laughs> is tricky. Oh man. Oh, this could be big. He needs to get a stock from this. Oh, and that's just like that. The down the tilt, tilt to forward. forward air, yeah. Down tilt, I don't, oh, I don't believe it combos into up smash anymore, but I think it combos into forward air now. Don't quote me on that. Don't quote me on anything. Yeah. It's always, it's always, uh, it's always weird to see like Greninja's like down tilt and like his dash attack, because the animations are like so similar. Yeah. <laughs> it's not for anything, it's just a new champ. Alright, we're gonna take it about for the guys. And immediately just starting off with the meaty forward air, dude, 14%. I like this music. Yo, know, where this is this is this is bumping. Now, one thing actually that you'll notice is that Greninja's low profile is really helping out uh, Venya right here. Because Marth wants to be spacing, like, he needs to be doing later aerials if he wants to be hitting uh, Greninja if he's dashing back and forth with dash attacks. Wow, he actually hit him in between the side beats. This is actually sh uh, literally the. Oh my god, I was about to say it's so even. Yeah, that was. Uh. A little bit of a, a little bit of flood, but it's all good. All right, but now Mr. E, you know, definitely just kind of just needs to run away, run away to leave. Don't he doesn't he doesn't need to stop playing his game because it, uh, Venya is gonna expect E to just like you know play more reserve. So here's the thing: is that a lot of the time when we've seen Mr. E's neutral against other players, he likes throwing out moves like sort of just like almost like actions per minute where he's like, I'm gonna throw out a move. Here, side B, oh, jabs, you know, try and keep that up. Vinia is not falling for that at all. Like, he's doing an amazing job of just, like, staying outside of the range of these little moves and finding the openings. Oh, no, yeah, for sure. And he just... When he lands, he makes sure to get himself out of the disadvantage state as quickly as possible. And that's something that Mr. E isn't, you know, that's, that's something that he did do just now as he comes out with that aggressive option. That yeah, upbeat out of yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm, so I, strong. I definitely think you, you're right, man. I, I think it may have been both. Oh! oh! Speaking of strong. Okay, we have the wave landings too. Okay, E, I see you, baby. All right, then you with. All right, why is this song going so hard right now, though? <laughs> right? Like, I'm actually just like head bump into what? it. I'm like, yo, ooh, ooh, got him. Did they get? Did they get? Oh, the shadow sneak. Did yeah, he right. do the theme? Okay, now, finally, Venia with a little bit of stage positioning that could help out possibly a bunch. Yeah, just get a little bit of, I think that moves. But that was, that was smart by Mr. E. Uh, actually, waiting until Greninja used the Hydro Pump, to, uh, so then that way he can use the up afterwards. Yeah, so if he up a little bit too early and he gets hit by just the tiniest bit of that, and he's going to be so far away, yeah. you know, he's, he'd be done. It was very, very smart by E. 
forward air gonna take it, man. Then he is so good at like like the I guess the mobility of Greninja means that the tiniest whiff can just be punished so effectively. There are not a lot of characters in the game that can actually punish Mark for spacing moves in neutral like that. There's not many players other than Venia. This music's too it's too good. Oh my god. <laughs> this, 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 this is epic. I'm tired and I'm hungry. I this, actually, is, this, is, this is epic right now. I, I can't believe it. As we see Mr. E trying to close it on venues with these forward airs, but all oh, maybe try, uh, try to re 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 roll with the shield breaker. Venia is just going hard. Is that it? No, he's just barely ah, surviving it with a little bit of hurt box shifting too. Oh. That's Ooh, it's the uppy not going to get the initial hit. It can actually be so hard for you when you get that big read. You think you've won the game, and then all of a sudden, don't trust. Got to don't it don't trust the, the the cinematic animation. Don't, don't trust, trust it. it at all. Don't trust oh it. Oh my god, we're being lied to. Oh, now Venny is the one trapped in the corner. Mister E has to capitalize on this. The up air that should do it, and there it That's finally it. is. Yeah. Whew. He had like three chances. He's been having a real problem today. He, he, like, he, he has he the had, lead. He had three chances so many leads. To, uh, to live. <laughs> that was a game saying, all right, <laughs> you better kill him before he kills you. Um, but then you're doing such a good job of just not wavering, you know, keeping keeping on that pressure. And okay, here we have so the I, switch. I completely we, so he has been struggling about with it. killing in winners finals with Jen. He's also struggling to close out games. So I think that the Lucina pick. I understand like Marth is sort of what he's more known for, and definitely his expertise with Marth being able to space tippers is so good. But I think you just need a little bit of raw consistency. Yeah, no, and that's why a lot of players like 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 I said it before, they opt to do they opt to pick Lucina just for that reason. Because now with the you know with the, with the tilt or or an aerial, Mr. E's not gonna really have the problem killing that he, that he has this mark. Then again, if he does find himself from behind, it'll be harder to make those crazy comebacks. Oh yeah! Oh, oh my God! He's a jump. What? Oh, that was suspicious. <laughs> <laughs> that up be such a quick move in the air. This I don't think Greninja can shadow sneak cancel and stuff. Can he? I haven't seen Venya do it, and he likes to do it. So. Venya catching Mr. E's jump and. Look at this pressure. He's still following him down and a down tilt to forward air. This could very well be the right. end for Mr. E. Like this, this momentum is just too much to deny. Right. Especially against a player who's so momentum based like Venio. Um, All right, well, there you go. <laughs> Try to get a little bit you wanna too kill, You want to kill your momentum? Do that. Does that side be have explode? Why does that last move sound like an explosive, like a like a because dynamite you, going? Because off? you're getting hit by a dynamite. As Mr. E, oh, unfortunately, Mr. Reed uh, tries to get a tech read on the forward smash. Forces oh, him to wow. air dodge, but Mr. E air dodging onto the stage, getting clipped with that up smash. And now Venny is just taking his comfortable lead. But we've seen Benny, uh, uh, so we've seen Mr. E in trouble. Lead similar to this. Let's see if he can finally reverse right. fate and make a, uh, a comeback here. But oh, just the overwhelming fury that is Benny right now. Oh, oh, he's trying to get nasty. Okay, maybe, maybe. Okay, if you, if you do that, Benny, uh, if, if you go oh, on no, stage. Yeah, that was, yeah. Okay. Uh, Heavy forward smash punish. Good job by E and putting himself back in this back in this game. This is absolutely back in this. I, I is he actually gonna make this comeback? Like, especially if because I, if you're Venia, like keep in mind Venia is such a momentum-based player that getting one or two really solid killers like that can I, just end up going so much on his mental yeah, game. Yeah, but if, you, if you're Mr. E, you got you got it. You gotta get hype. You gotta get hype for yourself right now, man. You have the opportunity to bring this back. Oh, smart. Not jumping because he knows that Benny has been catching him every time he jumps. That's actually gonna be the, the comeback? No way! And Mr. E catches it. He's look at him, look at him. He's like, yeah, All right, we're Benia. back in here, baby. We are back in here. Okay, Venia has to be beating himself up a little bit because he lost that. that has he had such a yeah. big lead and then he lost it because of that silly edge guard he went for. Remember um, that one? Because it put well, him yeah. off stage well, the and then he did the rising the counter. And oh yeah, the rising counter definitely. Well, no, but he was only off stage because he 
went off stage. You know? How, that, yeah, it's usually how that works. <laughs> no, 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 no. Like, you can go off stage because your opponent hits you off stage. Oh, well, fair enough. Fair That's enough. actually, like, there's a, that happens a lot. <laughs> Nonsense. Anyway. I, don't, I don't know what the off stage feels like. I've never been hit there. <laughs> Never been off stage before. Top 10 lies told in Smash. <laughs> All right, but we're taking it to town and city. A bit of space, maybe what uh, Mr. E need, needed as... What's well, Venny's counter? Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And right. I think, actually, space for Venny makes more sense. Greninja having you, amazing mobility. You, you saw what he did to Nixie on Kalos. Venny loves that space. All right, once again, waiting, waiting, waiting at the up B. Yeah, Benny also giving me a lot of space on the ledge. I don't know if he has... Okay, he does have a jump. You do have Ooh. also... I don't know if you've noticed this, but there's a new sort of pointer that shows where he's heading when he does up B. It's the same with Pikachu. It's really hard to react to. I don't know why they put it in there. <laughs> oh! Next time he uses up B, follow the red arrow. Who? Arrow. Greninja? Benia. Oh! It shows where he's going. Where he's headed. Yeah, I've noticed that, but I'm like, I just thought like it was, it was like some special effect. Ah. Hopefully that arrow isn't correct right now because then it means that Benio would be going down. Ah. He is not going down. Maybe down in history for winning three Xenos in a row right off the bat. It, would this really be his third win? If he manages, well, not yet. Even if he manages to beat E here and then manages to get the oh reversal. Oh my gosh! Oh my god, so much damage! Benio! <laughs> he almost gets it all right there, but E surviving, but what kind of life is this to come back to? This amphibian does not play around as he swallows Mr. E's second stock. Mr. Venia, sir, please. How is it that, like, Venia was known for his sick combos in Smash 4. How is it that his ultimate combos in a month are already looking even crisper? Excuse me. All right. Oh, my God. Okay, and Venia. He's going on the platform, too. Resetting it and bringing the tech that right, time. He's, he's feeling himself. This, oh. this pressure is insane. And Mr. E doesn't. Does it look like he knows how to, he, he, he's able to deal with this right now? He has to find a way. He has to seal a stock ASAP. Get himself back in the game somehow. All that, that uh, if you finish that, it would have killed. Okay, guess down tilt up smash does in fact still work because there we see it. Game three, a three stop. That was just the way that Venia played. This man is on fire. I, if you're Jen sitting in the corner, you have to be I'd like, be like, ah, damn. Uh, <laughs> Way. Palutena versus Venia. Jen versus Venia is going to be a real slobber knocker. We yeah, knowing saw that how he was able to do just amazing work against Mr. E. Let's see if he's able to do that once more. For sure. Venia, uh, Jen actually run. took out Venia at uh, Let's Make Moves in order to get to, uh, in order to make top eight. So, do you know the overall record between these two? Men? Oh, I have to no get idea. a. Uh, it's, get a, get a. Uh, he double eliminated him yesterday. They went 2-1 yesterday. They went 2-1 last week. Four and Jen is looking two or four and three or something. Jen looking clean right now. Having Venya at such high percent. And oh, smart option by Venya to just stay down. Hey, that's a ton of damage, but Jen is still in the lead here. Quite solidly, actually. All right, just take... Oh? I believe Paladin still has her reflector, right? It just yeah. comboed into her downbeat. I wonder if we might see Ooh. some of that. Good option to make that tilt. Also, he has to be, really has to be a little bit careful with um, a B. He's getting his uh, water reflected back at him is maybe one of the funniest things in the world. Because he's in free fall still. He gets pushed away by his own water in free fall. <laughs> Why is there a UFO in the background of Animal Crossing? Was that always there? Uh, yes, it's from the game. <laughs> what? what? <laughs> Alright, here we have this solution right now. Just trying to get around, trying to get around, trying to get around each other and trying to get around that platform. Oh, Gen 2 framing the, the, that up but... Unfortunately, 
not punishing him. Look at these guys. Move! Oh, Up air is man. not gonna kill just yet. But it is getting but mighty that close. back here will. Yeah, Venia is against the ropes here. He's from loser, so he only has one set to work with. If he drops this game, he has to play, you know, his back to the wall for the rest of the night, pretty much. Otherwise, he's going to be losing that first place spot to Jen. For sure. And you saw that little string that Jen did. He's he, he looking like he has been his number right now. Oh, the oh. forward smash not hitting. That was actually really smart from Vanilla Lending with no lag, so he was just able to roll away from that huge punish. If any can take a stock here, he can keep himself in it, but every more percent he gets is just that much scarier. Explosive flame up air is going to do it. Yeah, and that's a trap. That's kind of what Palazan is like. You know, they, they use explosive flame and they, add, they use it not to hit you, although if it hits you, they're not going to complain. It's, but it's more to bait a reaction from you, you know, either a jump, an air dodge, or something. And then follow your, follow up with one of those quick areas that Peloton has. Some characters are just straight up, just straight up frame traps. Apparently <laughs> we're in the point of the night where money matches are being called. And this could possibly be the final game of this entire evening, ending at 12, oh, past 12.30. We are Thursday, boys. Let's see how this ends up working out. And he does, of course, still have a shot, but the way that that last game went, he's going to have to work extra hard, considering it feels like at least tonight, Jen has his number. Yeah, man. And Jen, every time that I play, that I see him, he just constantly improves. Taking Venya for a ride. Oh my gosh! The explosive flame forcing Venya to air dodge. Not capitalizing on the opportunity though. Oh, beautiful counter. Alright, Venya needs to find a way to. You know, Jen isn't getting hit by by these Greninja strings, and that's definitely that's definitely oh my god, the toss. Oh, the falling nair is gonna do it! No! Oh, they're actually air dodge. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Venya! Oh, no. That was wow. actually maybe the sickest bait I've seen ever. Sticking like, I... to the wall <laughs> and then just spiking him when he goes down there. Oh, freaking <laughs> galaxy brain! Oh, that's it. He has a lead now. No, he okay, don't. well, it's even. You know, he has a mental lead. Yeah, no, I mean, that's... Just back here to 14%? I don't know. Here, my here God. we have Venya, and that's... And this is... This, Venya's such a momentum-based player. Just when, he, when he starts to feel himself, he starts to, round, to run circles around your opponent. Yeah, yeah. Opponent. To the point where if you're Jen, you need to shut that down. You need to, like, take away the toy. Yeah, basically. Because otherwise, he's just going to continue to go in your face. That's a shock just gone. Look at that, and this is this could this could be a potential problem for Jen, as Venya is just turning it up, going from 50 to 100. It's 50 percent again, 68. Oh my God! Don't get too. Oh, I thought Venya was gonna down there again. Be a silly person. He's pretty silly, but not quite there yet. Good dash attack. Explosive flame. Oh! Just look at this pressure by Venya. Staying out of Palutena's range, too. It's He wants Jen to commit. Back air, not going to do it just yet. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh, no. Fool me once. Shame on me. Fool me twice. Shame on you. What? Wait, no. <laughs> I keep on getting that wrong. <laughs> It's okay. Oh, Venia, no. And Venia just lost this game. Calling it now. Jen is going to make this comeback. Uh, let's not forget, Jen is also somebody who feeds off of momentum. Maybe not to the absurd extent that Venia does, but look at this right now. 
Am I? Uh, when you have two momentum based players, this is what happens. Right, okay. I take back what I said. But, I mean, if he would have got the spike, he would have been right. Yeah. yeah fool, me, fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. Fool me three times. I, I got, yeah, I, I just I just messed that up. I'm sorry. <laughs> na, 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 na. All right, we are at game three of what could be the last. Ah, we are at game three at what, at what could be the last match of the night. Or there can be three more after this. Or maybe they'll do an emergency best three out of five. I don't think you could do that in brackets. Ah, uh, and what if the latest scene has ever ended? Two, one, I think we might be getting there. <laughs> All right, we are taking it to Smashville. Um, I do like this stage. I think that in terms of, uh, like, I haven't really seen Benny be able to use, oh, no, I have seen him be able to use that platform for those combos. And I'm really curious to see how he does it this time around. But at the very least, it's an extra landing option for uh, Palutena because of the ledge cancel up beat. Oh, yeah, for sure. And we see Jen doing very, very well on this. <gasps> oh, my God. Jen. He's fine. He, he He's fine. Tossed. Oh, I love the way that Jen is moving right now. He's been really, for the most of the night, he's been really on point with those dash attacks. Right there, Venny had punished it. Ends up getting back thrown in just a bit, but he's still alive. And if he is alive, he has the potential to take this stock first. We've seen him do it before. No water, no water cling on this time, though. That is he's going to have to do a next level <laughs> galaxy brain. Wait, all right. <laughs> but that was three back throws, and he's like, you know what? If he's not going to die from back throw, I'm just going to back him. He's going to take this. All right, here we go. Chen just... <laughs> Keeping, keeping Venya out right now. And for every move that Venya does, Jen has an answer. Venya needs to. He's taken 37% this entire game. That's actually. He ridiculous. is upset about what just happened to him. Yeah, he's mad. He's mad. <laughs> All right, you had your fun. All right, we see Venya slowing down the pace of the game a little bit. Was that actually the first game Jen lost tonight? No, no. The last game? I mean, I'm pretty sure he lost a game. But you know? I mean, the way he's playing right now, I'd be, wouldn't be surprised if he hasn't. Wow, with the aggressive option to back here. That move has such a little lag. He was able to shield it. Venia is alive, but not by much. Another back throw will do it. Dash attack. Not All right, quite. This, I, that dash attack has to have some interesting properties because he's, he's hitting them. And they're not clanking. <laughs> oh, you know, it, it just beats out. Is she uses a shield? Yeah, she uses is, a is shield. Is that why? Is she that just a moment? Beats, yeah, just beats, it has like the trample or whatever. It just beats out moves. Like the back okay. air. Back air also does that. Yeah, all right. I'm just, I, I was wondering, like, does she have the moves that, does she have the, uh, the same properties as, as the back air for the dash attack? <laughs> she does. I apologize. Was that a hiccup? <laughs> that was a hiccup. I, I'm, was, I'm sorry uh, to all my fans. I'll try and be better. Uh, very interesting hiccup, but aside from the from the noises that uh, that salty makes. Ooh! All right, the trade. Benya at sixty six percent. If this is the time, if there's a time to turn up, it is now from Benya. And if you are Jen, you can't consider this to just be like you know a win in the bag. Oh! Did you see that snipe? He meant to snipe him coming out of it, and that gave him extra time for this. A little more punish, and, and for the first time, I'm seeing Benya just be defensive. <laughs> no, he can be defensive. No, no, no like I know, I know that he can, but the amount of aggression from this guy has been insane all match, and he's just running circles around people. And that's why he needs to play maybe a little bit more safe, at least for now. The back throw almost did it. Just one key mess up, and that's it. The tournament is over, and he has to the walk Oz away. The is gonna do it, and Jen's gonna take Zeno, the number. The 142, 142, 142, 143. Yeah, you're right. 143. 140, got 143. Look, See, Devin, not look, even you I'm know. living in the past. Right, and Jen's going to take Zeno 143. Never. Right here with the up smash read. Boom. On the freaking. So good. 
spot dodge. That was beautiful. Yeah, no, Jen doing an amazing job. I know he's been having a real great tear in New York here and showing his stuff. Actually getting a Xeno under this his kid, belt. This that kid, is a this kid's insane, quantifiable man. proof. This kid's insane, man. I know that he's been wanting this Z 